So let's solve this problem. So for this antiderivative, then using this formula, so we have the integral of u to the power n du. This is equal to u to the power n plus 1 over n plus 1. So take note that this exponent and this denominator must be equal then plus c. So for this given to find the antiderivative, so first we need to rewrite this given integrate every terms and put all the constant outside then take note that for the integral of dx this is equal to x so for this given for this term put this constant outside so this becomes 5 then the integral of x to the power 3 then the dx then minus for this term, put the constant outside, then we have the integral of x to the power 2, then the dx, then minus for these terms, since there is no constant, so this becomes the integral of x, then the dx, and for these terms, so plus, put the constant outside, then we have the integral of dx, then to find out the antiderivative, so using this formula, so plus 1 for the exponent, so bring down the constant, then times plus 1 for the exponent, so this becomes x to the power 4 over, so this exponent and this denominator must be equal, so over 4, then we have minus, so bring down the constant, then times, plus 1 for the exponent, so this becomes x to the power 3, then also over 3, then minus, since x has 1 exponent, then plus 1, so this becomes x to the power 2, then over 2, then plus 7, then the integral of dx is x, so plus 7x, then plus c. Then to simplify, so this becomes 5 over 4, then x to the power 4, then minus 3 divided by 3, this one is cancel. So we have x to the power 3, then minus, so this becomes 1 half then x to the power 2, then plus 7x, then plus c. So this is now the antiderivative. Then for this given, so again, we need to rewrite this given, so integrate every terms. So for this term, so since there is no constant, so this becomes the integral of x to the power 4 dx, then minus for this term, so put the constant outside, then we have the integral of x to the power 2 over 3, then the dx. And for this term, so put the constant outside, then we have the integral of x times the dx. And for this term, so minus 9, then the integral of dx. Then to evaluate now the antiderivative, so plus 1 for the exponent, so plus 1, so this becomes x to the power 5, and the denominator is also 5, then minus, so bring down the constant, then times, plus 1 for the exponent, so for a fraction plus 1, so if we have 7 over 2 plus 1, so just add these two numbers, so we have 7 plus 2, that's 9, then copy the denominator, so for this 2 over 3 plus 1, so we have 2 plus 3, that's 5, so this becomes x to the power 5, then copy the denominator, then over, this is also equal to 5 over 3, then plus, so we have 7, so bring down the constant. Then this is 1 plus 1, so this becomes x to the power 2 over 2, then minus 9 integral of dx is x, then plus c. 
then to simplify so this is 1 over 5 x to the power 5 minus 4 then take the reciprocal so this becomes 3 over 5 so the reciprocal of 5 over 3 then times x to the power 5 over 3 then plus so we have 7 over 2 x to the power 2 minus 9x then plus c then to simplify so this is 1 over 5 x to the power 5 then minus so multiply this 4 and 3 so 4 times 3 this is 12 then over 5 then we have x to the power 5 over 3 then plus 7 over 2 x to the power 2 minus 9 x then plus c so this is now the antiderivative then for is given so using the general power formula so first we need to put this constant outside so this becomes 7 then the integral of 3x plus 6 to the power 4 dx then using now the u substitution so we let u equals this equation inside the parentheses so 3x plus 6 and du so the derivative of 3x plus 6 so this is equal to 3 then the dx and to solve for dx divide both sides by 3 so we have du over 3 is equal to dx then using now this u substitution so just copy the constant then we have the integral so this equation inside the parenthesis that's u so this is u to the power 4 and dx is du over 3 so we have du over 3 then put this denominator 3 outside and this becomes 7 over 3 then the integral of u to the power 4 du then apply now this formula so we have 7 over 3 then we have u plus 1 that's to the power 5 then over 5 plus c then substitute now the value of u and multiply this 3 and 5 so this is 7 over 15 then u u is 3x plus 6 so we have 3x plus 6 to the power 5 plus c then for this given so first we need to bring up this equation and put this constant outside so this becomes 3 then the integral of 2x squared minus 7 and this exponent becomes negative 3 then we have x times dx then apply now the u substitution so u equals the equation inside the parenthesis and the u so the derivative of 2x squared this is 4x then the dx and divide both sides by 4 so we have du over 4 equals x dx then apply now the u substitution so bring down the constant then we have the integral of u to the power negative 3 and x dx is du over 4 and put this denominator 4 outside so this becomes 3 over 4 then the integral of u to the power negative 3 then the du and apply now this formula 
So plus 1 for the exponents, so negative 3 plus 1. This is u to the power negative 2, then also over negative 2, then plus e. Then to simplify, so multiply this 4 and negative 2. So this is 3, then over negative 8, then times u. And u is 2x squared minus 7 to the power negative 2 plus c. So this is now the antiderivative. And for is given, so first, we need to rewrite this radical in exponential form. So since we have the cube root of x squared, this becomes x to the power 2 over 3. So the root is the denominator of the exponent. So for this given, so put this constant outside, then we have the integral of 3x minus 4, and this becomes to the power 3 over 5. So the root is the denominator. Then we have the dx. Then apply now the u substitution. So u equals 3x minus 4 and du. So the derivative of 3x, that's 3. Then the dx. Then divide both sides by 3. So du over 3 is equal to dx. Then apply now the substitution. So just copy the constant. Then we have the integral of u to the power 3 over 5 and dx is du over 3 and put this denominator 3 outside so this becomes 5 over 3 then the integral of u to the power 3 over 5 then the du then apply now this formula, so plus 1 for the exponent, so 3 over 5 plus 1, so this becomes u, so just add these two numbers, 3 plus 5, that's 8, then copy the denominator, then over, this is also 8 over 5, then plus c. Then to simplify, so this becomes 5 over 3 times the reciprocal of 8 over 5 is 5 over 8. Then we have u to the power 8 over 5, then plus c. Then this becomes 5 times 5. This is 25, then over. 3 times 8, this is 24, and u, u is 3x minus 4 to the power 3 over 5 plus e. And for this given, so using the exponential equation, so we have a to the power u, and take note that a is a constant, so for this given, a is equal to 5 and u is the exponent. So u is equal to 4x minus 7 and du. So this is 4dx. Then divide both sides by 4. So du over 4 is equal to dx. Then apply now the substitution. So we have the integral of 5 because a is equal to 5 to the power u and dx is du over 4 then put this denominator 4 outside so this becomes 1 over 4 then the integral of 5 to the power u du then apply now this formula so this is 1 over 4 times 5 to the power u and u 
is 4x minus 7 then over ln a and a is equal to 5 then plus c or this is equal to 5 to the power 4x minus 7 then over so multiply that's 4 then ln 5 plus c then for this given, so again, A is equal to 6 and U is 5x squared plus 8. Then DU, DU is equal to 10x, then the DX, then divide both sides by 10. So DU over 10 is equal to x DX. Then apply now the substitution, so this becomes the integral of 6 to the power u, then du over 10. Then put this denominator 10 outside, so this becomes 1 over 10, then the integral of 6 to the power u, du. Then apply now this formula. So this is 1 over 10, then times 6 to the power u, and u is 5x squared plus 8, then over ln 6, then plus c. Or this is equal to 6 to the power 5x squared plus 8, then over 10. Then ln 6 plus C. Then for this given, so using U substitution, so U is the exponent, so that's 7x plus 9 and DU. This is 7dx, then divide both sides by 7. So DU over 7 is equal to DX. Then apply now the substitution, so we have the integral of e to the power u because the exponent is equal to u and dx is du over 7 and put this denominator 7 outside. So this is 1 over 7, then the integral of e to the power u du. Then apply now the formula, so this becomes... 1 over 7, then e to the power u plus c. Then replace now the value of u, so this becomes 1 over 7, then e to the power u is 7x plus 9, then plus c. Then for this given, so again, first, Put this constant outside, then we have e to the power 3x squared minus 1, then the x dx. Then again, u equals the exponent 3x squared minus 1, and du, this is 6x dx. Then divide by 6, so du over 6 is equal to x dx. Then apply now the substitution, so this is 4, then we have the integral of e to the power u, and x dx is du over 6, then put this 6 outside, so we have 4 over 6, then the integral of e to the power u du, and using now this formula, then we need to reduce this 4 and 6, so divisible by 2. So this is 2 over 3, then we have e to the power u plus c. Then substitute now the value of u, so this is e to the power u, and u is 3x squared minus 1 plus c.